Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Nicholas Davenport here, brand ambassador of FitLight and director of programmer and founder of Mind Body One. And I'm here at the Mind Body One lab, which is currently under construction. Been working on the past few uh, weeks, trying to get ready to go to bring cognitive conditioning methods using all kinds of things, such as the FitLight system, of course. But um, just want to talk a little bit about how the world in general around me has been shifting since COVID-19 has changed how we live. Like, at first it was slow. I remember it's funny because I was on a plane coming back from Chicago when news was really breaking how big a deal this was. And I'm on a plane and everyone was freaking out. And even the lady next to me was like coughing. So it was crazy. But we and myself did not know what was next to come. Because at that point, my business was kind of on an incline training different populations. I've been working with military, law enforcement, consulting with businesses. So I was growing, great for me, right? But unfortunately, the world shut down. In-person businesses less and less and to the point that it was no more for a while. Now they're starting to open back up, but I had to go through some trials and tribulations. Uh, I had to refund some uh, contracts that I had in advance and give that back and make do. I had some uh, other things going on. So it's been, it's been kind of a struggle. But fortunately enough, I was able to pivot and take my methodology and, and create some online content to be able to at least try to stay afloat. Now slowly but surely it's been increasing and all, along the way I've, I've made some uh, endeavors that have kind of put me in a place that I can grow. Like I said, I'm here at the Mind Body One Lab where I'll be able to house my own methodology here and I'll be able to implement different drills for research, training, uh, recreational purposes, to be able to really spread what I'm doing here and I can do it remotely. We can have some socially distanced uh, classes as well and courses too, to really spread the mind by the one cognitive conditioning method. Because at the end of the day, this, this the show, I say the show must go on, right? But what I'm doing, trying to train the brain through the unique methods I've created, has to keep going. And despite that the world shut down and and there's been loss of life, and there's other things going on outside of COVID-19, everyone's kind of going through it. And I feel if we all just keep positive, and I don't mean that in a cliche way, I just mean that we keep fighting for what we're trying to do, because like I said, I had to pivot. That means I had to take what I was already doing instead of going straight ahead, because that road was kind of blocked off. I had to kind of step to the side and find a different route. And I believe that's gonna work. So with that being said, I'm very optimistic of what the future will bring when I get the lab finally finished and everything that's gonna come with that. I'm very excited and happy to see where it can go and I will continue to get people's mind right and also having them see the light. Uh, sprint back. Why don't you turn the sprint back? Huh? Sprint back. Right. Now it's going to start picking up. Now there we go. Ooh, Try to shake you. 